Hey you guys, it's Vijaya back at you with another video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make coconut burfi cupcakes. It's my hybrid dessert of the year, you guys. I love cupcakes and coconut burfi is an amazing fudge that's flavored with cardamom and coconut. And we're gonna use that as the frosting on top of a cardamom flavored cupcake. I've tested the recipe, it is so, so good and I can't wait for you guys to try it as well. But before we get into the recipe, don't forget to hit me up on the gram. That's where you can stay in touch with me on a day-to-day -day basis and see what I'm getting up to. And of course, if you're looking for the full recipe, just click that info box down below and everything you need is there. Let's go make some Indian cupcakes. So we're gonna start by making the cupcake batter. And one of the first ingredients that I'm gonna work on is curdling my whole milk. So we're making a homemade buttermilk. It's not traditional per se, but it does the trick because I find a lot of the time in baking recipes that call for buttermilk, you buy it once, you use it for that recipe and you never use it again, which makes absolutely no sense to me. So we're gonna use things that we have on hand to make buttermilk. So I have a little bit of milk here naturally, and to that I'm gonna squeeze in about a tablespoon of lemon juice. We're gonna give it a stir and let it hang on the counter. So we're gonna give it a stir and look, almost instantly it has curdled and this is exactly what you're looking for. Now we're gonna work on my dry ingredients. So I have a little bit of all-purpose flour that's gonna go into this bowl. We're gonna to top it off with some baking soda, some baking powder, as well as a little sprinkle of salt. I'm just gonna fork all those ingredients through so that they're nice and combined. I have a stand mixer that's fitted with a paddle attachment and to my bowl, I'm gonna add a couple of large eggs. I'm gonna pour in some white sugar. I'm gonna just drop the top down and we're gonna whisk this up until it's nice and smooth. I'm gonna sprinkle in my ground cardamom, a little bit of vanilla, and my oil. And we're gonna mix this again until it's well combined. Now we're gonna be adding our dry ingredients as well as that buttermilk that we prepared in increments. So I'm gonna go in with just a touch of flour. We're gonna let that blend up. Then we're gonna add a touch of buttermilk, let that blend up and keep doing that until we've used up both of those ingredients. In with a little bit of the buttermilk. And we mix again. And just like that, our cupcake batter is done. Take a look, it smells amazing. It's not super thick, it's on the thinner side and that's gonna result in a really moist cupcake. And now all that's left to do is to scoop it out into a cupcake tin. And my favorite way to scoop up the batter is with an ice cream scoop because you get the right portion every single time. And you wanna make sure that your liners are filled up about three quarters of the way. My cupcakes are good to go. My oven is preheated to 350 degrees. I'm gonna pop these guys in for about 16 minutes or until a toothpick inserted in the middle comes out somewhat clean. And I have to say that this recipe only makes nine cupcakes. So if you have more friends coming over, make sure to double up. Let's go. So while my cupcakes are baking away, we're gonna get started on our coconut burfi topping, which is so simple to make. So I have a little bit of desiccated unsweetened coconut that's gonna go into the pot. I'm gonna to top that off with a little bit of milk and one of my favorite ingredients of all time, condensed milk. That's milk that's been cooked down with sugar until it's nice and thick. And now we're gonna bring this to the stove and cook it out until it gets nice and fudgy in texture. So I'm gonna turn my heat to about medium high and we're gonna start stirring all of these ingredients and they're gonna take about 10 minutes to cook and all. So I've turned my heat off, everything is nice and fudgy and thick. I'm gonna sprinkle in my ground cardamom. Cardamom is so iconic when it comes to Indian desserts. It has a beautiful floral aroma and we're just gonna mix that in. It smells so, so good and we're gonna let this mixture cool to room temperature. So this is what the cupcakes look like when they're done. 
nice and fluffy and tall and we just let them cool to room temperature. And I'm just gonna chop up a few pistachios. These are gonna go on top after and we're gonna give them a rough chop. All right, so now I'm gonna use a little mini ice cream scoop. I find that it's super easy to do it that way and scoop out my coconut burfi on top. And then we're just gonna use the back, <laughs> the back of the scoop to just smooth it out. Doesn't that look amazing? And now we're gonna top the rest. Now the jewel to each of these cupcake crowns is a nice sprinkling of crushed pistachios on top. Look at how gorgeous. And this guy has my name written all over him. Oh my goodness, we're gonna peel it back. It looks so fluffy, the cupcake. Here goes, this is gonna be a big bite, I think. Mm. You guys, this is the cupcake to end all cupcakes, okay? The cake itself is so moist and light and the pairing of the vanilla and cardamom, they go so well together. So, so delicious, not overly sweet, but the kicker is that coconut burfi on top. It's a little chewy, it's a little creamy, that flavor of cardamom just comes through. It's nice and delicate and then topped with those crunchy pistachios. You have fluffy on the bottom, chewy, a little creamy on top and crunchy. Oh, such a great combination. This is an eats meets West dessert with this hybrid coconut burfi cupcake. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to give me a big ol' Thumbs up, you know how that makes me feel. If you're new to the channel, thank you so much for joining me. Please subscribe for more videos. And as always, if you have a question, comment, concern, leave it in the comments box down below. Until my next video, I will continue eating cupcakes. See you later, guys.